Good morning, Fort Recovery Middle School students and staff. This is uh, Mr. Stahl and little Mr. Stahl coming at you with your announcements for Wednesday, April 1st. So congratulations, students and staff. We've made it to April, um, and it is USA Day today. It's part of our virtual spirit week. So hopefully you guys are rocking your red, white, and blue like me and the little man are here today um, to celebrate the United States and rep uh, a little school spirit during virtual spirit week. So happy uh, Wednesday, April 1st. It is April Fool's Day, right? It's April Fool's Day today. Uh, so if you got a joke or something, play on your brother and sister. I'm all about that action, so good luck with that. Uh, and then tomorrow's reading day, right? Finishing up virtual re uh, virtual spirit week is going to be reading day tomorrow. Uh, so go ahead and, and send your photos in. If you got your red, white, and blue on today, send those in to me. We'll get them up on social media um, and let everybody know. But today's, like I said, USA Day. Tomorrow's going to be reading day, and we will um, we'll go from there. So hopefully you're participating and having some fun with that during the course of this week. A um, couple birthdays today for April 1st. Two birthdays today. I want to say happy birthday to Trevor Heitkamp and happy birthday to Jacob Fortkamp. So both of you guys, hopefully you're safe out there and you have the opportunity to enjoy your birthday a little bit, have fun. Um, but happy birthday to Trevor Heitkamp and Jacob Fortkamp. You guys are birthdays today, April 1st. Lunch on your own today. All right, no lunch menu from the cafeteria. So you guys are on your own today for lunch. Got a few announcements. All right, just a couple of quick announcements here. Number one, hopefully you guys had the opportunity to look at our district Facebook Live event yesterday. Um, some of the administrators got together and we put out a little Facebook Live post. Uh, you can go back to our website, Fort Recovery Schools Facebook page, and rewatch it if you want to. Um, but we did have a chance to kind of go over just a couple of district-wide things about some changes with the extension of the school closure to May 1st. All right, So that puts us right now, students, coming back to school on May 4th, okay? Um, obviously, that's a long way away and a lot could change, but that's kind of where we stand right now. So as a result of that, though, school buildings and facilities, everything's still closed, all right? Just like, the, you know, the SAC, um, the, the, the football field, the track, things like that, all of those things are still closed as a result of the school closure till May 1st. Uh, and then also, the other thing during that time is spring break, okay? We had spring break um, scheduled for April... 6, or not April 6, excuse me, April 9th, April 10th, and April 13th, all right, so spring break for next week, April 9th, 10th, and the 13th, that is still as scheduled, okay, so that is still on the schedule for those days off, those are not going to be new assignment days, those are going to be days off for students and staff and everybody, so that's going to be spring break next week starting on Thursday, April 9th, um, and then also the other thing a couple people have been asking me is about computer issues, if you have computer issues, um, and you need something fixed, you need something repaired, we're still doing that, all right? The school's still offering that service. Check the website, all right? Under the coronavirus link on the school page, there is a lot of different information on how to access computer fixes. So the school is still doing that. If you have a school device, uh, let us know, and, and we can set you up with a way to fix it, okay? So that information is on the website, or just email me, and I can point you in the right direction if your computer's not working. Uh, and then the last thing here, students, is uh, obviously the Washington... DC trip for the eighth grade. Okay, I don't know if you saw that late Facebook Live event yesterday. I kind of mentioned it a little bit in my announcements yesterday. But as a result of the school closure period extending all the way through April, um, that is going to force us to postpone. All right, the eighth grade trip to the fall of 2020. Okay, so we will get you uh, as soon as I'm done here on the announcements. I'm going to push out an email to the uh, parents of the eighth graders as well as the eighth grade students themselves, uh, kind of getting you the dates for that, but it is going to be postponed. We're still kind of working with K&K &K to finalize things. We'll let you guys know here very, very shortly, all right? Um, so I do apologize for that. Unfortunately, it was really the only decision that we can make at this point um, is to postpone that, and so we'll get you more information here soon. Uh, with that being said, little man's getting restless. we got to get going here on, uh, on Wednesday, so you guys have a great rest of the day, and we'll see you back here tomorrow. All right, happy USA Day.